Hello everyone. Welcome back to Midas Quick Learning video series. So in this video, we will be talking about simulation of temporary supports and like creation of new structure. So if we talk about rehabilitation process, then we know that many a times we need to remove any kind of structure that has been degraded and we need to create a new structure at that location. So we will try to simulate that in today's video. So for doing that, we will be using the construction stages. So as of now, if you can see, these are the groups that we are having and for my girder I am having these elements while if you check the section so these are the girder sections for me I will use the line mode like this and here if we check the groups so I have removed this intermediate elements from this group because I will be removing them in a construction stage and we will create new elements for that so for doing that we will simply create a new structure group like this name it as R1 and I will add another construction stage group R2 I inactive these elements we select these elements and we link it to this group now I want to remove that element in my last construction stage so as of now we are having these construction stages till stage 5 and I have created new construction stage R1 and R2 so if we go here to add a construction stage we simply click on add and here you can define a construction stage so in the R1 basically we will be deactivating the elements R1 which are these and before that we will quickly activate them over here so I will activate this R1 with the girder so if I check this now so in stage 2 you can see we are having the whole structure and in R1 we will deactivate this group like this so if you see stage 5 all the girders are present while under stage R1 these are deactivated so these are actually removed now since we have removed this structure there will be discontinuity and we need to give temporary support at these locations so since that is a practical approach whenever we try to create new structure by removing any we provide form work and the temporary supports at those locations so we will also simulate that for doing that I will quickly create a new boundary group we need to go under the construction stage to make any changes so like this we go under the base stage and then I can create a new boundary group and another boundary we go we select the temporary supports and now we need to give the stiffnesses in the respective direction so in this case we want to give high stiffness in the global Z direction that is in the upward direction to provide the supports so for that I will give high value in the SDZ since this is global coordinate system and for the others I am giving nominal values like this then we need to select the nodes so for the ease of selection we will just activate this group and select both the nodes and we provide our temporary supports like this it's okay and under the construction stage we will go and we will activate this boundary group temporary support like this so under the stage R1 where my structures are removing I am activating that so you can see we are having the temporary supports now in the next stage we will be removing these boundary supports and we will be creating new elements in that location so for doing that I will simply activate the nodes and we can create elements like this so I am having this menu section to define at these locations material will be grade C3500 and I will link these new created elements and this R2 and under the R2 stage we will activate them like this and we will deactivate the boundary group now if we check all the construction stages so under stage 5 we are having this 
stage R1 you can see the girder is being deactivated and stage R2 new elements has been created which are these and the temporary supports are also removed so in this way you can simulate any kind of construction stages in Midas Civil and be it rehabilitation or any kind of process so I hope this video was helpful for you see you in the next thank you